people in Thailand, they think this is useless. There's no reason to do this. But for some of us, this is samurai training. And then you'll make an effect like samurai training. Because what you can do is this is compost. Most people in the rural areas of Thailand just burn all of this. But if you take the branches, the small branches, and put it like a ground cover and also you can take a lawnmower over it and it will be either be compost or be a ground cover which is very good for saving water and many other benefits and the the thicker branches you can uh, pile over somewhere else and we can these bigger branches we can use for making uh, charcoal or something else and also people can sell it we would like to show people how to make the charcoal in a good way without making a lot of smoke because smoke is not good for the health and your lungs and, and if you just burn all these branches and leaves like this, there will be a lot of smoke into the air and it's not good for your children. Here are the branches that we can use for making uh, charcoal. Hi, this guy is a uh, vegan Illuminati. <laughs> I don't think you should say that because maybe, I don't know, because we, if we are doing this for promoting the vegan camp, it's not, maybe not so good to say I'm Illuminati. <laughs> people don't know what that means except five people in the world. <laughs> Do you know what Illuminati is? Yes, you can yeah. Some people like to run or do some other exercise, but this exercise is just much cooler for me because I can exercise and I can uh, save the world at the same time. I make the compost, which makes all the other plants around here grow better. So for me, it's the best exercise ever. I like to run sometimes too, but I think uh, everybody could benefit more of doing like more composting and stuff like that as a part of their daily routine of uh, training. Good thing. And of course, eat your plants and go vegan. But otherwise, we want to spread it out a little bit so we can uh, go with the lawnmower and to make the compost easier to, so it will decompose faster. And don't, forget. and don't forget to drink your water. Some people think that um, drinking a lot of water will flush out the minerals in your body. There's like no studies showing that if you drink too much water you will flush out your minerals. The body is smart, it will keep the minerals. It will just flush out the water with the pee without taking out the minerals. The most important part of the, the water is that you flush out all your uh, waste materials from bodies. When we're moving all the time there are like waste materials that need to get out of the body and the primary way for the body to get rid of all these waste materials is through the pee. So you need to drink a lot of water especially if you're in uh, Thailand and you're working in a hot environment. And You need to have a lot of water to pee a lot and pee needs to be clear. That's one of the first things I learned when I was 18 years old and went to the civil defense in Denmark where we were taught as firefighters. Firefighters are sweating a lot because they need to be able to go into a fire so for them to have like super clean pee at their best at all times their pee needs to be clear we were told to drink water all the time so cheers last time we just do a shackle from that barrel you can watch the video here